Ladies and gentlemen, I'm standing here with the new ECW Light Heavyweight Champion, TJP. First, congratulations for regaining the title that you lost a couple months ago. But ladies and gentlemen, I just want to ask this champ, what is next for you for that? You do know, I think in my opinion, but Paul London does have a rematch clause for that title. Will you think that you would accept the challenge? And one thing is, what's next if you beat Paul London again? First thing, Michael, I have no problem facing Paul London. I'm not afraid of, 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 of facing people. My mind has always had been to be the best fighting champion. So, Paul London, if you're going to use your rematch call, I'd accept. But it's going to be on my time and the right place. And that is defending this light heavyweight championship at the biggest stage. Slammiversary. All right. Well, thank you much, Paul London. And I think that will be an amazing match for the light heavyweight champion at Slammiversary. Let's hope that that match made it official. Let's, ladies and gentlemen, let's go right now to our next broadcast, and that is my striker stand by with Paul London. Wow, what a opportunity for Paul London Paul London for you to accept the rematch claw, and it's gonna take place at the bigger stage, Slammiversary. I know that that will be one of the matches that you're looking forward to see. So what do you have to say to respond? By TJP. First thing, congratulations, champ. You might have beat me. Only hold that title for one day. Right now, I'm going to do everything I can to focus on regaining that title. And you say you want to face me at Slammiversary? I'd accept your deal. Let's hope that the management are listening to make this official. Right now, my striker, this interview is over. All right, ladies and gentlemen, will it be an official? We'll find out. Thanks for watching ECW After Show.